feel has been, these are the good questions, okay. <laughs> your greatest challenge to date? I would say I was so surprised at how lonely entrepreneurship is. Mm. I mean, you hear that, but until you're walking that walk, you don't realize it. Yeah. So I went through a bit of a struggle. I decided to do some side projects because of it, because I needed to connect with people. Yeah. Especially in the wintertime when I'm not at markets, I was craving that human connection. Yeah. And so I started a podcast and- Of course you did. <laughs> of course I did. And I had female entrepreneurs on it just so I could have that connection with people again. So yeah. I would say going through that little, that spout was pretty difficult. Thank you for sharing that because that's like the raw real side, the unglamorous side of entrepreneurship. I'm a huge advocate for mental health, but one of the things I do a lot of um, talks on is depression in solopreneur entrepreneurship because you're isolated. And you know what? I'm not afraid or shy to say that I also saw a therapist. He helped me see things differently as well. And yeah. mm -hmm. I just knew that I couldn't do it on my own. And yeah. I think that's a reoccurring thing yeah. in my life is that tenacity and that perseverance you can do it on your own you can do it on your own but you can't yeah and so I was pretty proud of myself when I made the phone call to tell you the truth because it uh, it changed my life it really did 